In today's video, we're playing Kerbal Space Program. Our goal for the video is to get old Jeb here to the service of the Mun and back. We're gonna try to get as many science points along the way as we can also. This video was live streamed, so if you'd like to be a part of the next one, look out for the next stream. So I think I wanna do a manned mission, so we're gonna have to start with the command pod. What I found to be good is I use this service bay and then inside of it, you can put the, this, the experiment storage unit, um, not right there. So that I can put the stuff that I need in there. We know that this needs to come back into the atmosphere. So I think I'm gonna use a heat shield here. So this is gonna be what actually comes back to Kerbin. I'm gonna do a, a little test launch. Okay, so this looks like it lands okay. Um, oh, that launches very quickly. So. We'll just have to like launch pretty gently because off the surface of the, the mun it's gonna be very quick. Oh, we have no fins, so this oh, is gonna on SAS. We'll see how this goes. We're gonna do a little test. Oh, those are all out already. And then we have, this one is gonna take off from the mun. Try not to use the side rockets, they're very inefficient. Oh, that, that is good to know. Test it? Okay, everyone wants me to test it. I guess we're gonna we're gonna go for it. Okay, I I honestly do not think it's gonna work, but we're gonna try it. Let's do it. Okay, it it's it's off. It's off the ground. So we're gonna want to start going, tilting it to the right, so we can get into an orbit that's like pretty equal to the moon's orbit. Maybe go a little faster and then start tilting it. Ah, uh, fly rocket, fly. <laughs> I know the basic idea of what we need to do. We need to get it into orbit around Kerbin and then a transfer orbit to the Mun and then descend down. Oh, my solid fuel. Okay, those broke off. They didn't hit the rocket. Um, it's a little wobbly. Stabilize the wobble. Come on, come on, Jebediah. Stabilize the wobble. Uh-oh, I can't look at chat. I'm gonna die. Uh-oh, this is not working. Tilt up more. We're barely accelerating. Okay, this is a disaster. Go up! Okay, we're going like completely um, flat now, which is not helpful. <laughs> we're gonna need more structuralness. After a couple more redesigns and the game crashing. Oh, did the game just crash? We came up with this rocket. We'll try it. Let's go Jeb. Okay. So far, so good. Very gently start to tilt it. See the atmosphere, some air resistance going on. Be careful when turning, yeah, I. you gotta be careful. Oh, it looks like we're going a little too fast. We're getting some atmosphere stuff going on. Okay, for here, we want those to break off. Okay, this looks a little better, I think. Um, we still have like half of our fuel in this one. And once this gets a little higher, we, I think we're gonna wanna tilt it down somewhere. Set a maneuver node. Okay, let's do that, add maneuver. We get into orbit. 50 second burn time. We'll start at 25. Go, go for burn. We should be good. This should get us into orbit. And then we have a whole nother stage to get us to the Mun. We're gonna do it. This is gonna be it. It's working pretty good. This is definitely the coolest rocket I've ever designed. Um, you guys definitely helped a lot. Okay, we're getting into orbit. This is totally gonna work. Just barely ran out. Okay, we're still in orbit though. Yeah, we're fine. We're in orbit now, so let's stage. Okay, now we need to get into the orbit of the Mun. So let's add a maneuver node here and just go prograde until there's an encounter. Where's, maybe a little more. There we go, okay, here's an encounter. Okay, that'll work, we'll do that. Warp to next maneuver. Okay, we got a minute 42 burn time. About now, let's start the burn. Oh, stage, stage, okay. We're burning now. We're gonna see, we might be able to land and not come back. Oh, it's gonna be just enough. You can see it has 780 and we have 680 Delta V burn. So this will be perfect. So you can see our orbit's gonna grow. And so the Mun is gonna be about here when we encounter it. So we need to continue this burn until we get there. Okay, five, four, three. Okay, so we're, I'm gonna watch this. And okay, boom, maneuver done. So now let's warp till our encounter. And then we can deal with getting into orbit of the Mun. 
Okay, so now we make a maneuver here and we want to slow down. Okay, well that will crash us right into it. Okay, about 20,000 meters. So we only got to burn for 41 seconds. Here we go. This is it. This is it. I can feel it. But I'm going to warp till we get around 20 seconds. 23, 22, 21. And we're going to burn. And this engine's going to run out, so we're going to have to stage. And it's out. Stage. Okay, this one's going to have to burn a little more. This is our actual lander stage. <laughs> We're, I don't know if we're gonna have enough fuel to come back. This is our comeback engine. Three, two, one, zero, good. So now we're gonna want to add a maneuver here and slow down enough to that. Just barely get on the surface. Okay, so, oh boy. I don't know about this. We got 192 meters per second is what we need for this burn. And we have 327 left. Um, and this one, we could technically land with our last stage but it doesn't have any landing struts. So we're gonna see. I'll go for it if we can though. So we only need to burn for seven seconds. Oh, I missed it. Okay, we're, we're fine, we're fine. We got it. This one isn't a super precise one. This is just to get down to the surface. So at this current trajectory, we will be going here. Okay, put these out. And we're gonna wanna go retrograde. We're going 537. We don't have enough Delta V in our stage here. So I might just burn the rest of it off really quick so we can focus on a precise landing with our final stage. Okay, um, this stage is out, so we can't land. So we're gonna have to land with this stage even though there's no landing struts. We're gonna try it because we have enough Delta V to land. I don't know about go home, but enough to land. Once you get near the surface, you should do something called a suicide burn. You basically burn at the very last second to use the least amount of fuel possible. We could try it. Let's do it. Because um, I don't really have a lot of options here. We can't get too close to these craters. So I actually want to burn sideways to try to stop that. I don't think you have enough fuel to get home, but you can always send a rescue craft. That is true. We're going to do the suicide burn, I think. Wait till we get closer. So how fast does this go? It goes pretty quick, so I think we can wait a decently long time. You can barely return if you land perfectly. Okay, here we go. Jeb, we're so close, Jeb. I don't know how close I should wait before I start boosting. Here. Uh-oh, I think I waited too long. <gasps> ah! Okay, okay, wait. He's alive, he's alive. We waited too long on the burn, but Jeb survived. <laughs> He's alive. Jeb is alive. And that's all that matters because we can send a rescue craft. We can still EVA. So he made it to the moon. Okay, so he made it. He's alive. That's that's the most important thing. <laughs> Let's go. We did it. Um, and we can do take a surface sample. So look, if we return this, it's 120 science. But the problem is our rocket is definitely not going to be able to get back right now. Plant flag. Yeah, we gotta plant our flag. Boom! We did it! Okay, we're definitely gonna have to do a rescue mission. So we might have to do that another day um, in part two. But he made it. <laughs>